Hi guys, it's time for another video. It starts off with some old footage that I've realised I'd still got on my phone and I hadn't uploaded and then it goes into this week. Start off with I think it's a bit of bailing, then some ploughing and then back on the bailing. Sorry some of the audio is not great, especially when I was on the plough. Had the back window open because we had the screen protector on and there's a lot of noise coming in so I'll try and improve that. Somehow next week, hopefully we'll finish bailing and the screen protectors come off and you'll be able to see in out the back window. So. Biggest combine. <laughs> no, it's, just, it's a plot combine. It's about, I don't know, four or five foot wide, I think. So you just bang on a few rows here. Oh, we're now banging some wheat straw. This was turned yesterday. <laughs> I think the other guy is filming me, but I'm filming him. Oh, well, never mind. Yeah, we've got, we've got everyone out today. Well, as in the trailer. Nathan, you have it, Nathan. Strikes again. There's something else in this one. Oh, Nathan's talking on the CB. 
Yeah, here he is loading the trailer. And here I am, baby. We're going up a hill now. I can tell we've had um, rain and the ground is more soft. It's more struggles to put it up the hill. If you look, going 11, 12 kilometers now. It's not an overly steep hill. If you watch when we get to the top of the hill and turn around, show you the speed of what it is when we're going going down the hill so I've got it set at 17 kilometers an hour bad so we'll just see how we get on
the other field. So now we've got this row of lights right in the middle. So I'm going to plow this side of the lights, and he's going to plow the other side of the lights. So yeah, they're rather frustrating these lights up. They haven't, they haven't got them on tonight. Sometimes in the evening they're they're on, but no, they're not on tonight. So. Saturday morning, both pals ready. We're now about to go out and carry on plowing. We just started on a, another field. This was should have been not last year, but not the year before. And apparently, on fields like this, there's a big problem with wasness because apparently they like the sweetness of the sugar beet. Apparently, so to make sure we've got the window shut because my, my friend Dan he got he got stung rather badly and he ended up uh, ended up in hospital with a heart monitor and everything because he got out and stuck stood on a nest he didn't know was there so just have to be extra careful this year I'm just uh, straightening up the straightening up the uh, the fire get it to be in line with the, the field. I've got the old um, GPS on again to try and get it nice and straight. It's not, I don't know if you can see it up there, it's not, it's not too bad, there's a bit of a wiggle at the end there. But yeah, that's what we're up to now. You're now going to say, you've plowed that bit. Yeah, I know I have, but when you uh, straighten out from going at an angle, I know this one, neighbouring farm several years ago, you plowed the wrong way, when you've got lots of little shorts like that, and then plowed the other way, which is what I'm doing now, it'll be, it'll make it a lot, a lot, a lot more level, so that's what I'm in the process of doing. It's the same day as this ploughing. We're now this evening, it's about oh, okay, seven o'clock I think. We're back, we dropped the plough off and we're now back ploughing, ploughing I mean, baling some linseed. So I'm baling the stacker and the current will be in later because there's not there's not a huge amount of straw here yet, so I haven't got enough bales for a load. I've only done seven. So, yeah, not ready for a load yet. Right, it's Saturday night, it's about 11 o'clock, and I've just had a problem with this sensor in there. This thing goes up and down, and this sensor down here goes past that when it's up. If you look in further in there, you can see there's the magnet and there's the sensor. But when it was a dropping down this piece of metal here it moved ever so slightly and it wasn't passing it and it wasn't sensing this sensor wasn't sensing it was going down so the whole system stopped working I've just spent I don't know half three quarters an hour fiddling about with that I finally got it working because I've, I've finished but the whole I couldn't fold the this uh, sledge up here on the back I couldn't fold it up when it was in that position but I've got it folded up now so now I can go go home Thanks guys for watching another one of my videos. Please give a thumbs up and comment. Hardly any of you are commenting. I get about one comment possibly a week. There's over 100 people watching it. No one's commenting. You have to write something down. Come on, write something down. And subscribe, which is down here. And another of my videos linked will be here. 
So, see you guys. Cheers for watching. Bye-bye.